एवरीवन वेलकम टू पावर ग्रीन टीवी सब्सक्राइब फॉर मोर वीडियोस एंड गेट फास्ट नोटिफिकेशन ऑफ द वीडियो प्लीज लाइक सब्सक्राइब कमेंट एंड शेयर क्लास सेवन कंप्यूटर चैप्टर फाइव एथिक्स एंड सेफ्टी मेजर्स क्वेश्चंस एंड आंसर्स Exercise 1. Fill in the blanks. A. Spamming is an unwanted junk mail. B. A password should consist of at least 8 characters. C. Digital footprint is also known as digital shadow. D. Plagiarism is the act of copying someone else's work and publishing and showcasing it as one's own work. 2. Select the most suitable alternative. A. Which of the following is not a type of software piracy? I. Soft loading. E. Hard disk loading. E. Online piracy. IV. Phishing. Answer IV. Phishing. B. The person engaged in hacking is said as. I. Hacker. E. Plunderer. E. Thief. IV. None of these. Answer I. Hacker. C. Which of the following is a type of hacking? I. Website hacking. E. Network. E. Online banking hacking. I. V. All of these. Answer I. V. All of these. D. Which of the following is related with spamming? I. Slows down the server. E. Consume lots of network. E. Waste time of the recipients. I. V. All of these. Answer I. V. All of these. A. Which of the following is related with the application of internet? I. E. Shopping. E. Online education. E. Email. I. V. All of these. Answer I. V. All of these. 3. Differentiate between. A. Hacking and ethical hacking. Answer I. Hacking. Hacking signifies an unauthorized intrusion, entry without permission, into a computer or a network to steal data or information from a computer which is on network. E. Ethical hacking involves an authorized attempt to gain an authorized access to a computer system, application, or data. Carrying out an ethical hack involves duplicating strategies and actions of malicious attackers. B. Active digital footprint and passive digital footprint. Answer I. Active digital footprint. When you deliberately share your personal data on the internet, it is known as active digital footprint. E. Passive digital footprint. When your personal data and the details of activities are traced on the internet without your knowledge or permission, it is known as passive digital footprint. 4. Answer the following questions. A. Explain computer ethics. 
Answer Computer ethics involves the code of conduct to use information technology in a responsible way. It fulfills the requirements of an individual user without manipulating or destroying the data of any other user. B. What are the types of software piracy? Answer. The types of software piracy are as follows. Soft lifting. Hard disk loading. Renting. OEM unbundling. Counterfeiting. Online piracy. C. Explain about the advantages of Internet. Answer. Advantages of Internet are I. Hub of knowledge. Whenever we want some information about any topic or subject, we can instantly find information by searching on the Internet and gain valuable knowledges. E. Storing information on cloud. We can store important information on platforms like Google Drive and DigiLocker. This enables us to access our own information anywhere in the world without carrying them. E. Online education. Due to internet concept of online classroom has evolved. You can attend classes, give examinations and get the results on internet-based platforms like Zoom, Google Meet ETC, that provide a very convenient way for teachers to take online classroom session and students can attend classes right from their homes. IV Doorstep food delivery. Earlier, whenever we felt like eating outside in a restaurant, like Swiggy and Zomato, we can order food from our favorite restaurant and get it delivered to our home. Thus, Internet has given us the power to enjoy our fabau right food while staying inside the comfort of our home. We Online shopping, we can easily search for different products, compare the prices and can buy and get the products delivered right at our doorstep. Internet has significantly improved our shopping experience. D. Explain the rules of doing ethical hacking. Answer. The most important rules of ethical hacking. An ethical hacker must seek authorization from the organization that owns the system. Hackers should obtain complete approval before performing any security assessment on the system or network. A. Explain cyberbullying with the help of an example. Answer. Cyberbullying is an act of threatening, harassing, humiliating, embarrassing, or targeting a person by another person using the internet, digital technologies, or mobile phones. Some examples of cyberbullying are posting embarrassing photos of the targeted victim, sending threats via online platforms, spreading rumors about the victim, by falsifying stuff. F. List the safety measures that should be taken while accessing internet on computer. Answer I. Get the latest antivirus and firewall software. E. 
Update your internet browser. E. Create a strong and easy to remember password. I. V. Use a different password to the one you use for other services. V. Change your password on a regular basis. V. Never share your password. V. Don't let your browser remember your log on details. 5. Write short notes on A. Phishing Answer Phishing is a type of social engineering and cybersecurity attack where the attacker impersonates someone else via email or other electronic communication methods, including social networks and short message service SMS text messages, to reveal sensitive information. B. Plagiarism Answer Plagiarism means copying the content or ideas or words of another source without informing them and expressing it as your own. C. Right to Privacy Answer, it is a right which protects the inner sphere of the individual from interference from both state and non-state actors and allows the individuals to make autonomous life choices. D. Cybercrime Answer, cybercrime is a criminal activity that either targets or uses a computer, computer network or network device. A. E. Intellectual property rights. Answer, intellectual property rights refers to the legal rights given to the inventor or creator to protect his invention. Next chapter 6 subscribe for more videos and get faster notification of the video. Thanks for watching this video. Keep watching with Power Brain TV.